This is a story about dinosaurs, of course, but also of heroes, of bravery, of friendship, and of a little boy named Avery. I have been studying dinosaurs for 25 years, but I have been in love with them since I was five. I got a call from a friend who knew a little boy, Avery, who was only four years old and who loved dinosaurs. Avery knew every dinosaur and couldn't get enough of them. My friend asked if Avery, his dad and big brother could come to our lab. When Avery walked into my lab, it was impossible not to smile. His excitement was contagious. A few months prior, Avery couldn't walk at all. A tumor had invaded his spine. Avery has cancer, Wilms tumor stage five. It is a children's cancer and very rare. When he walked in, he went right to one of our teaching casts. His eyes lit up as he said, look, it's a Pachycephalosaurus. He knew every dinosaur we had, not from pictures or plastic figures, but the 3D models themselves. After seeing all he could, Avery sat down with me to show me his dinosaur book. He can't read yet, but he knew every word and every dinosaur's name. This is the magic of dinosaurs, and this is why we do what we do. For the science, yes. For understanding our planet and where we came from. But mostly, it is to inspire wonder in the next generation of paleontologists. 